<laughs> well, it is indeed an honor to win Mr. Coney Island 1931. The secret to my bodybuilding success? Well, I guess it's keeping to a strict diet and exercise regimen. You know, doctors have proven that in order to have a healthy body, you have to get your vitamins from smoking at least one pack of Lady Pleasers a day and get your nutrients from hydrating with plenty of screwdrivers. That's freshly squeezed orange juice and vodka. Well, it doesn't matter what kind of vodka, so long as it's cold. Oh, and be sure to get strong bones by eating lots of fettuccine Alfredo. We're the greatest generation. Okay, every eye closed. My eyes are closed. Let's take some deep ujjayi breaths. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the nose. Do as I say, not as I do. All right. Looking good. All right, let's meditate on what makes us happy. I know what makes me happy. No, seriously, they're coming for me. Well, today is officially the worst day of my life. Seventh grade sucks. I hate being a teacher. I was all excited to wear what I thought was a pretty sweet new pair of Skechers to school today, and then Jessica Sinclair Lewis told me they made me look like I work in a penis factory. I don't even know what that is. But that's not the worst part. One of the students started a rumor that I have two buttholes. So I went to the library and Googled what if I have two buttholes just to see if it's a thing. Turns out it is. But then the students found it in my search history. How am I gonna prove to everyone that I just have one butthole without further stigmatizing people with multiple buttholes? Hey, roomies, y'all asleep? Oh, sorry. I'm just super nervous to share this prison cell with y'all, and when I get nervous, I get chatty, and I need to talk, and it's like, Raymond, shut up, man! <laughs> y'all, we're stuck here for life, so let's just get this awkwardness out of the way and get to know each other. I got a good idea. Let's share our deepest, darkest secrets. I'll start. One time, I accidentally ate someone, and I have two buttholes. What? It's not weird. It's kind of nice, actually. Too bad I'm not a bottom, though. That'd be double the fun for you two, <laughs> right? You did it! You did it, you big guys! All right! You chosen and wise me! None have made it this far! Game over, Percival Blusterwing. <laughs> and no prize for second place. That's too bad for you. I'm the one with the gum. <laughs> so, Dave, just curious, fish any band aids out of the pool filter lately? <laughs> uh, seven? Oh, gross, seven. <laughs> Must suck to be a glorified water janitor. Hey, well check this out, buddy. Let me show you how some real guarding is done. Yeah. Out too far, back in the box. <laughs> you guys talking about sticks? Yeah. Fuck sticks. Oh, fuck sticks. <laughs> Things, terrible 
of things. I tried to hunt the giant panda to extinction. <laughs> Spent six months in China with a big net and a baseball bat. <laughs> Didn't get them all, but I got most of them. <laughs> I lost a lot of friends after that. But then I came here and the Lord said, I don't care what you did. I'll forgive you. I'll be your friend. And he's been my friend now for six years. Mm. My only friend, because now I hunt homeless people for sport off exit five, but that's okay, because I'm going to heaven when I die, because Jesus doesn't give a shit. <laughs> All right, now you get out there, and you put your tiny penis in whatever vagina or butthole you find. <laughs>